Welcome to you all to the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. Martin Tyler here along with Alan Smith. Premier League football is coming right up for you. Manchester City and they take on Crystal Palace. Yeah, real buzz around this ground. Full house. A lot of interest in it. Hope it doesn't disappoint. John Stone. Thank you for attending the Etihad Stadium. Well, Manchester City have been here for a good few years now. Their second home, if you like, after Main Road and... Of course, already history here, that never-to-be-forgotten day when Edin Dzeko and then Sergio Aguero scored those two added time goals to win the title for City in 2012. Yeah, I think if they play here for another 100 years, they're not going to repeat that kind of drama. Precious memories for everybody wearing sky blue. It's good attacking. It's Aguero! Can't get the shot through. Good block. It's gone out for a throw. Now you've got your chance to check on the lineup for the home team. The goalkeeper is Edison. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in the middle of midfield. Sergio Aguero is the sole striker. He's a danger, isn't he? He'll run in behind. He's run offside this time, though. Yeah, he's a nightmare for defenders. You can see them they're a little bit twitchy, trying to keep him quiet. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Gaeta is in goal. Cheku Kuyate plays alongside Luka Milivojevic in midfield. And the last player on the team sheet is... Jotong! How did he reach that? Brilliant goalkeeping. Put the corner in the middle. Quite a few players went to meet that corner, but no one made any contact. Well, the player's broken down now. A strong player, and he shielded it well. They've been trying to do this, get the ball over the top. He's seen that room is on the inside. Good vision. Up for grabs here. Leading the scoring chance in the league, Manchester City. Yeah, these home fans have been treated to some fantastic football and great goals. Bernardo Silva. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender acted very promptly and decisively. James MacArthur. Zaha delivered into the box. An opportunity goes begging because of the interception, which is absolutely vital. Aguero. Slipped through by Aguero. Sterling. He has cleared it well. The game being played in one half of the pitch at the moment. The team with possession finding it hard, though, to get into areas where they're going to score a goal. Now Zaha. Cahill. He's got it back again from his teammate. Strong, fair challenge. Balls out for a throw, though. Some players arriving in the middle now. Patrick van Aanholt. Aim for those in the middle. It's Bernardo Silva. That's well worked by City here. And they're going forward to put them in front. Well, they got away with it in the end. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. Patrick van Aanholt. Zaha. Difficult for the defender against a player who wants to take him on like this. He went in well. No surprise to see City ahead in the possession stakes, but I am expecting to see a bit more from them in the remainder of this match. I think they do. Aguero! Well, that was so close to going inside the post, but it's just straight past the outside. Yeah, I think he'd beaten the keeper, you know, but just not got it within the framework of the goals, and he's a bit unlucky. Silva. It's with De Bruyne. Walker. Sergio Aguero now. It's with De Bruyne. That's out of danger there with that clearance. Here's Walker. 
It's De Bruyne going forward well. They're coming in at the back post, his teammates. He couldn't have hit that better. Difficult technique. Yeah, and you've got to have confidence to take that on, and he is playing with confidence. Takes a lot of concentration, this kind of volley, and look at him. Eyes fixed firmly on the ball. Gets it all right here. Manchester City in front. Manchester City goal. Number 10. And the players face another two minutes added on by the referee. Cahill. Milivojevic. James McArthur. So it's 1 0 here as the half time whistle goes. Well, this is the second half now, and it's underway. Blocked off the pass there. Aguero. An opportunity here. There's some space to work the ball into. Maybe he'll cross it here. Well, they might not be rushing to take the corner. They're a goal to the good, of course. Swung in by David Silva. And the keeper chooses to punch. Strong, powerful clearance. Aguero. Aguero! The shot is blocked. He's got that well out of harm's way. Well, time is ticking away. It's time for a change, and here it comes. Silva. We're looking for a couple of killer passes here from the attacking team against defenders that are really earning their money. Sterling. Cleverly done. That was tight, and the keeper had to be brave to get there. Here's Sterling. And the tackler has been very successful there. He's got possession. Sergio Aguero. Super block. And puts away the penalty. Good confidence, great connection. Yeah, he's a man you can depend on in these situations because he does keep a clear and cool head. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. We've had an hour gone here, and there's still 30 minutes left. Sergio Aguero now. Well, he's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception, made it look easy, actually. And that's gone out for a throw-in. The shot's on! He's got there and turned it over the bar. Corner now for Manchester City. He's got it away. John Stones. Oh, that will be a free kick for Manchester City. It's with De Bruyne. Very good tackle. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Here's Aguero. Good defending. Milivojevic. James MacArthur. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. He's got it in behind the defenders for the attacker to chase. It's another one for them. They go further in front and they are full value for this position. Manchester City. Moving into what should be, Alan, an unassailable lead. I would have thought so, barring any catastrophic errors, they're there. 
Well, here we go again, and they can't wait to get the ball back from the kickoff and try and get another one. Number seven, Raheem Sterling. Crystal Palace are going to make an alteration. There's a substitute coming on. Routine for the keeper. City boss in this in terms of control in possession. And it's been a really impressive performance, the way they've used the width of the pitch. They've swung some really good crosses in. The strikers have been on top of the game. That's a straightforward piece of work for the goalkeeper. Read the intentions. In behind the defenders. No, it's offside. A substitute coming on. It's a tactical change. He'll be disappointed with the way he's given the ball away. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. James MacArthur. That was catching practice for the goalkeeper. Aguero. Now De Bruyne. Sergio Aguero. Aguero! Must be! Well, now it looks like a question of just how many. They really are on top now, stretching the lead, looking like the real winners of this match. Well, it was a gift. Strikers dream about moments like this. A tap-in. Yes, yeah, not often that you do get what is literally an open goal. And he wasn't going to miss it. Well, it's a tough game for the team that are trailing. They're out of the contest, really. They're just playing for pride. They're really being torn apart. Sometimes being a favourite in a match can weigh heavily, expectation and all that. It's not a problem for this team, is it? No, I think their manager will be delighted because they've not uh, taken it easily at all. They've given respect to their opponents, but they've shown the class too. Well, they put the squeeze on and stopped the opposition playing out. Well, the game has run its course here, and there's the final whistle. Well, at times you thought they got a bit greedy, but why not? I mean, if you're on top of an opponent like they were here today, rub it in. Well, they did. They were ruthless, weren't they? They rubbed their faces into the dirt, and uh, that is the hallmark of a top side.